And welcome back to Roofnet. Yes, the Dwarven Fortress that is on the ocean. So let's clear this up here. Maybe. Yes. Yeah. Right. So. We're definitely on the ocean. Yep, nice big flat area. Some pools of salt water that we can't drink. That. Yeah, my the Mayday set comes with the strangest. I don't understand why he seems to like those two buttons above the numpad for changing Z levels. And I'm going to go ahead and switch that right now because it drives me completely batty. Uh, okay, up and down. He didn't switch. Plus and minus. Page that he did. He did switch them back over there. Okay, yeah, that's not happening. So page set them up. Okay. Up. Down. I think. Hopefully. Okay. Switch down to. Save and export to text. Again, just make sure we're through. And we return to the game. Okay, now that that's out of the way. First start, got all our animals, our peasants. Okay, this will be the last video before I name people. After I record this video, I shall hold off until I get some comments on the first video. So, we got water, and nothing. So, we need to dig down at least a little bit, get some stone, get a palisade wall up. So, we need to go in and designate who is going to be our miners. Because right now, six residents ain't going to cut it. Right, roof nets. So, Urbat, you have been chosen. Right. You're mining. And I am going to take up mining as well. Not the cow, just me. Right. And we only brought two pickaxes left, so. And the Aerith, you get to be a woodcutter for now. And I'll give you carpentry as well, just because. And Odom. Gathering. And you too, so I'll just do standing right there. I'll also give you processing and farming. Just in case. And that leaves you, Rudib, to pick up the slack. No slacking. Right. Animals everywhere. Okay, that's a good idea. So let's go ahead and get out of here. Take the nation. Start with a pit for animals. And two by two. That's not going to work, is it? Well, it will for now. So once that's going. Screwed up. Well, that's what we need. Downward step. And now we'll put it right here. Two by two. Down, upward stairway. Two by two. And some passageways. Just to get us started. Make sure they go down here. Don't intersect our. Hit. Quite that deep. Like that. Make 
time to change those before we dig them to up down stairways and continue down into the lower levels. Hopefully we won't hit a cave and we'll hit some stone. Meanwhile, up here, we need to clear cut some trees and grab some berries and whatnot. Get a little farm plot going. Okay, and away we go. farm types, one, two miners, and one woodcutter, which should leave us with two people who aren't doing anything. And yay, we have coal. That's good. Because lava made quite a ways down. Onyx is good too, so that'll be our stone level. We, we land that out just perfect, just enough to get into stone. Awesome. Get away, dig, dig, dig. I could be totally quiet, but just don't feel the need to. Okay, we have our pit. So we need to get rid of those ramps. Now, this will be the tricky part. Can they do it without being down in the pit when they're done? No. Duh. So we have to go ahead and dig that out and try to get some stone. I'm assuming here that this is onyx. No, it's claystone. Those must be onyxes. Coal and onyx is the same thing. Right, but either way, we want some stones. So we'll dig that out. Wood going on, so let's put in a wood stockpile. Just a small one, nothing too big. We also need some food over here. And that'll give the dwarf with nothing to do. Something to do. Right, get to work. Get lazy bones. More coal. Stop striking it and start mining it. Good, we have some stone. The reason I want the stone so much is I want to build a workshop. Mason's workshop. We'll just plop it right there for now. Clay stone and list. Masonry. And get that building going. Okay. And we come to mine. And it started raining. Wonderful. have to roof over that pit down there. I don't think it'll accumulate weather or water. I'm just not used to having the weather on. My computer is so old. I've got this new computer now that can run it. I'm so amazed. So we want some doors. Give us two doors. Three doors. Food stockpiles are full. Expand that a little bit. 
bit secondary. And we're working away. I think some of that stuff would rot out in the rain. I guess it does rot anyway. And we're out of time. So, just as everyone becomes a different named dwarf, I shall end the video, and I shall see you all next time.